Y'all better get y'all one. Now, once you once you downloaded that um Cool Edit Pro, you know, effects program, everything will be in direct X. All you have to do is refresh the effect list. Once the refresh list is uh refreshed, you know what I'm saying, you'll be able to use what you need. Um real quick, that was uh kinda long, it was almost ten minutes, so I'm going to cut this video short right here with this, and now I'm going to go straight into the part where I'm mixing. Remember how it sounds. So um, now what I'm going to do is, first and foremost, I always go to noise reduction. Because inside noise reduction is the first thing I want to do. I want to take as much noise reduction out. Boom. This is what you'll see, noise reduction, a box like that. But as long as you keep only noise, that's the key keep only noise don't go to remove noise keep only noise then go to get profile from selection this here is what you look for as long as that's level you're good or go to okay let that go keep in noise you know what I'm saying noise reduction that's good now this is where you go back to effects and you do the filter Graphic equalizer. Simple. Hit the S key. Select somewhere in there, then hit S. Go to simple bass cut. Very simple. Do that three times. Now, I'm going to tell you all what else to do. Okay. That was the first time we did that. Effects. Filters. Graphic equalizer. It's on a simple bass cut. We did it once. This is the second time we're going to do it. Again, this is the last time. We go to Effects. Go to Filters, Graphic Equalizer. After you do the noise reduction, you do this three times. The Graphic Equalizer three times. Hit OK. As long as it's always on Simple Bass Cut, you hit OK. Let it go through. Remember how my voice is sounding, y'all. Boom. Go back to Effects. It's very simple. Go to Amplitude. Inside of Amplitude, there's three options you need to select. First thing you do is Pan Expand. This, you always leave alone. So what you make sure is it's always on Master and Width. Make sure it's on Master and Width. Okay. Make sure that your whole entire wave looks like mine's on the computer screen. Go back into effects again. Go back into amplitude. This is the second option you have to pick. Normalize. Always make sure it's on 100. Normalize LR equal. That's all you need to worry about. Okay. Now, go back into effects, amplitude, and go to dynamic process. Inside dy dynamic processing, you'll see a list to the right of the presets you need to select the one that goes high limit. Limit hard 12 dB. Once that's selected, hit OK. Now, I'm going to let y'all hear the voice. The whole wave, as you see, has been compressed. It's much more equal. Actually, there's more space at the top and the bottom. So I'm going to just hit the space bar key here and let y'all hear how it sounds. All right? Kush from that store. If you even notice, my levels yeah, aren't see. as high as it right. was before. Yo, yo, this is sample one. I hope you like it. I don't care about the future, because I ain't that psychic. Fuck T-Mobile, I can give you a sidekick and chirp information over just like Nextel. My name ring bells like LL. Cool J, I'm that nigga that's cool. All day, y'all niggas is at... Now, y'all hearing that as clear as it will be, and I can make it higher, lower, or whatever. The key thing here is reverb. Shout out to my son Pharaoh and Wish because they put me on about the reverb and Dark Hero Ryu. Y'all know Aries. Y'all need to go check them out. Shout out to my man and his family. Um, them niggas, they hold us down. So definitely, definitely though, y'all want to do the exact mixing technique I did with the effects and the noise reduction, the graphics, the filters, you know, all that shit. Make sure you look at the video and do it. Now what I'm going to do is add the reverb and the delay and the compressor. Now is where I make the verse sound real without the ad-libs. Okay. Now, 
I go simply back to effects. And inside effects, I go to direct effects again. Now inside direct effects, they have time works. This is what I use a lot. The first thing I'm going to do is go to the waves. Usually there's a C1 folder. I don't have it installed at this time due to technical difficulties with the operating system I have, so I'm going to use this. Fuck it. C4. Use it. Always go to the top where it says no in the presets and come over and select four band noise reducer. Once that's select, hit OK. Now go back to effects. And you want to go back to direct effects because that's where you got all the nice stuff at right now. I'm going to go to time works and I'm going to put that compressor on. Right? Now I'm going to listen to the compressor first before I even do anything. Cause from that store, you got to see. Uh, yo, yo. This is sample one. I hope you like it. I don't care about the future because I ain't that psychic. Fuck T-Mobile, I can give you a sidekick and chirp. Hmm, there you go. I didn't even put the reverb on, so I'm gonna go put the reverb on right now. I'm sorry, y'all. Go back to effects. Go to um, delay effects. And I put on the simple, re matter of fact, I could put on the simple reverb. I could. But you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go to the direct effects and put on that reverb. The time works reverb. Cause from that store, you gotta see, um, yo, yo, this is sample one, I hope you like it, I don't care about the future cause I ain't that psychic, fuck T-Mobile, I can give you a sidekick and chirp information over just like Nextel, my name rings bells like LL, Cool J, I'm that nigga that's cool, all day. Now, little small reverb, you know. That's not really what I wanted, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it on anyway, the other reverb, by going back into delay, to effects, delay effects, and going down the reverb. Making sure I pick tight and close. Very simple. That will liven up the verbs. Now, go to play. Cause from that store, you got to sit on. Uh, Yo, yo, this is sample one. I hope you like it. I don't care about the future because I ain't that psychic. Fuck T-Mobile, I can give you a sidekick and chirp information over just like Nextel. My name rings bells like LL. All right. Now, notice that's just for track seven because the chorus is different. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just click at the beginning of track seven here and come back over here to this. When I right click on this, I'm going to go to insert. So it puts it directly under it. Now once that's directly under it, I'm going to right click on the bottom one and adjust the volume gently. I put the volume for instance on like maybe 6, no 7.3 is good for right now. And then this, I could like just put this to for instance 2.2, that's negative. So when I hear it together, it'll sound much clearer. Now I hear it with the whole track and we're gonna see what it sound like. Uh, uh, uh. See and the beat is the beat is too high, so I'ma fix that. Then you see me. I said one blunt, two blunt, three blunt, four. I want more cushion from that store. Where you put it from, you gotta show me. I need my copper out for that. Double all the deep blocks. Simple 